mission of the Reaper is both ISR, intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance, and also CAS, close air support. So not only are we helping uh, ground forces see what they need to see, but if they're in trouble, we have weapons that can uh, support suppressing the, the enemy forces. We are currently in the ground control station, what we consider the cockpit. So the pilot will sit on the left side, the sensor operator will sit on the right side, and they work together to execute the mission. The pilot obviously is controlling the aircraft and the movement of the aircraft, whereas the sensor is controlling the uh, sensor ball and actually moving that to, to look at different things, zoom in, zoom out. What we do is we actually utilize the different screens to have situational awareness of where we are, as well as knowing what our engine instruments are doing and the sensor capabilities of the cameras are allowing us to look at at any given time. Our video feed is literally being watched by people all over the country and the world. There's people down on the ground really relying on you getting the best picture of whatever they need you to look at. The near real-time information that we're gathering is, is just incredible. Now, senior leaders at all levels are able to watch these feeds of what a young pilot or sensor operator are doing every single day. We have the ability to stay airborne for 24-hour periods and tie all these different people into the scene and make uh, decisions very promptly. We're able to have more troops here at home, but at the same time having as much of an impact on getting the mission done overseas.